I am so excited to show you guys all of the new finds that I found at Dollar Tree. So if that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Y'all know how I roll if you've been around for a while. If you're new, hey, hi, how you doing? My name's Melissa. I'm the crazy crafty keto mama and I have littles and I have lots and lots to do. So I try not to edit my hauls, but I love to just bring you guys all of the cool new finds that I found at Dollar Tree. So without further ado, let's not waste any time. Let's jump in. Ah, I'm so excited, you guys. These are like the best finds that I have found in a while, okay? Dollar Tree is really stepping up their game and like, I can't even believe it, okay? Okay, look at this freaking sign. Dollar Tree. Oh my gosh, look at that, you guys. Look at the truck. It's hubcaps is raised, like it's got that little 3D effect. It's beautiful. I would not touch this sign. The pink truck is gorgeous for Easter. The uh, shiplap background, um, if y'all did not know, your girl loves shiplap, okay? I have shiplap in my bedroom and in our kid's bathroom and my bathroom, as you can see. So I love shiplap. I am all for it, and it looks really great. So it's got the little bead hanger. So I found the pink truck with the white background with a little bunny in the back. Isn't he cute? And then I also found the wood grain with the blue truck. This is also absolutely gorgeous. I can't tell which one I like better. Y'all let me know down in the comments. Do you, do you like the pink with the white or the natural wood with the teal color? And look how real that wood grain looks. Hang on, y'all. Let me. Y'all, it has been such a busy day. I am so stinking proud of myself. I literally trained 600 people today. Um, if you guys want to join me in business, I trained 600 people on three of my top tips on social media growth and like why I've been so successful in my businesses. But when you sign up with me, you literally get my one-on-one -on -one coaching. So anyway, um, let's just move on. But it's been a day. So I was just trying to explain where I'm at. Okay, y'all, I'm going a little crazy and it's been a long day. <laughs> You're gonna hear my little man having a good time out there. So um, look at this one, you guys. Come again dollar tree dollar tree for a dollar 25 i don't have that um dollar tree plus section okay not yet i'm waiting for it because the items look amazing i was looking online the items look absolutely amazing but i have i we only have the dollar 25 so i found this one and i love the shape of it and then i also found this easter farms egg sold here bunny treats no, what did I just say? Easter egg farms, bunny treats sold here. <sighs> Dollar Tree. Look at that um, buffalo check ribbon around the carrots. It's so good. It's so farmhouse. Don't need to touch this. I am absolutely love in love with this sign. Now, this one's cute. It's not my favorite. This one's definitely my favorite, but... I mean, come on, they're both absolutely gorgeous. So, I only picked up one of each. I'm trying to be good, y'all. If y'all seen the amount of signs that I have in my second shed, and my, y'all seen my shed already, the, all the signs I have in there, if y'all seen my second shed, it's ridiculous. My husband built like a, my own shelf just for the signs. He was so cute, he like laid them all out. It's, it's pretty much, the width of the back of the shed, which is 16 feet, filled with Dollar Tree signs. It's ridiculous. I don't need any more. I want more, but I don't need any more. Like, really Dollar Tree. Um, I'm just shocked, you guys. Like, pick my mouth up off the floor. Okay. Moving on. Keep, like, bending. <laughs> okay. So, the next item that I picked up were these cute little shaped gift bags. So you get two in a pack. I thought that these would be super cute to like maybe fill 
maybe put like a transfer on them. I'm not really too sure. I only picked up one pack, but stay tuned, Easter decor to come. And that's what I picked up these for. They'd also be really fun for like kids to like fill it up with little treats. Sorry y'all, this light on is driving me nuts. That one ain't bothering me. y'all did not know I just recently lost 80 pounds like what your girl feels like a skinny mini anyway okay moving on to the next item check this out you guys what? look it's got a little tail the gingham and it's a long garland there are one two three four five six pieces they're pretty thick, so I'm super impressed with those. I picked up two packs of those. They were just way too cute not to get two. The next garland that I picked up was this bunny and carrot one, and they're all different colors. They have the little pom-poms on the bunnies as well. So it goes orange, teal, orange, pink, orange, green, orange. So the carrot, the bunny in different colors. Carrot, bunny, different color. Carrot, bunny, different color. So I picked up one pack of those. And then the last garland I believe that I picked up was this little egg garland again with the buffalo check all different colors six pieces so yes dollar tree you are doing it now these were super cute but they were broken so i only picked up one they did have pink colors but the pinks were like really busted up so i only picked up this one just to show you guys because i thought it was just so stinking cute but I'm kind of sad that it's broken, but it just is what it is. They're little peep, little chick candles. Aren't they so stinking cute? I've never seen these at Dollar Tree before. Let me know down in the comments. Um, have you guys ever seen these before? And if you have seen them, did you see them this year? And were they all broken up at your store too? See that? But I thought that would be really cute on like a tiered tray. Um, you probably really wouldn't even really notice that it was broken. I don't know. But anyway, picked up one of those. I also picked up this truck bunny wreath rail. Um, now they have pictures. So I originally had picked up one of these for Valentine's Day and it had the heart on it. And I was like, I don't really know what a wreath rail is because all it had was like this part of the tag but now they give you kind of like an idea of what to do with your wreath rail and that's so cute now i personally don't like um whatever this is called i'm having a brain fart you guys i'm so tired but um i don't really like the it'll come to me in a second i don't really like that look so I would definitely do something different with this. Not too sure. So we'll see what I come up with. So I only picked up one of those. They also did have these in a bunny itself um, and a gnome holding a little bunny, but I just picked up the truck. Oh, they also did have some for St. Patty's Day as well, but that's about to come and go as quick as we can blink just like everything else so um those were like up at the front like buy these now because we're getting ready to get rid of them so i didn't pick up any of those because we don't celebrate saint patty's day and i also don't diy for saint patty's day um so i did not grab one of those but the next item i picked up and they did have several different styles of this if i can find it i will pop it up on my screen um, but I picked this up for my daughter's room. She, these are actually the colors in her room. The pink's probably a little dark, but that's okay. The, the, um, peachy color and like the greenish color is like her bedspread. 
and I do have like butterflies in there because it's a floral pattern. So I picked this up from my girl's room. Isn't she cute? I love that. I think they did a really nice job on that. It's like wood cut out and then they painted it. So I love that. Y'all are gonna love these. Y'all are gonna love them. <gasps> Dollar Tree and y'all these are super duper good size too so it's felt up here they got it right with the little jute bow the buffalo check and it's filled really nicely like you would this looks like you would pick this up at a high-end store for real like Kirkland's um, stuff like that I've seen stuff like that there. So they had several different patterns. Again, super impressed with how gorgeous these are. They're not tacky. They're, I'm not into like, I don't know, decor that looks like it's child's play. I'm just, I don't know. I guess my style is just different. And I love stuff that looks like this if you know what I mean. Super farmhousey, but st like, like it's on trend and super farmhousey, but it's still seasonal. So like these are for Easter, right? But they still look super high end and farmhouse and not too childish in my personal opinion. So I absolutely love these. So obviously I picked up two of the buffalo check ones just because oh i didn't realize they're different wait no they're not different are they i don't know y'all yeah they are a little bit different this one's a little bit lighter than this one so i don't know if that's intentional um but i purposely picked up two thinking these were the same because i love the buffalo check but hmm, oh no aren't they so cute oh my god I can't get enough, you guys. Dollar Tree impresses me more and more every time I go there. Um, because with the quarter increase, they've just been getting better and better and better items. And I'm just really, really proud of you, Dollar Tree. Attaboy. <laughs> we like a good bang for our buck, okay? Um, so the next item I picked up was this orange ribbon. They did have different ones, but they were just tacky to me. I don't really like them. That's just me, you guys. I'm not speaking for anybody else. I'm speaking for my home, my eyes, my mind, my style. And I just personally didn't like the other ribbons. Um, but I could get down with this one. So I just picked up one of these. Because I'm not going to be doing a ton more Easter crafts. Like, Easter's right around the corner. I'm sure everybody is over it. But I did want to at least just get maybe, hopefully, like, one more good Easter um, video in. I guess we'll see, right? Okay, so the next item I picked up, that's it for the Easter items. But while we're on the topic of ribbon... These were new. I've never seen these. And they are that floral garden um, brand. But aren't those like super interesting? I thought they were super cute. Super farmhousey. This one looks blue on camera. But I feel like that's black and white. I don't know. I can't really tell. Let me know. Does that look blue or black to y'all? But then I got the orange for Easter and then the tan. You can use that anytime. So I thought those were super cute, super interesting, very farmhousey. So I just picked up one of each of those. Oh, I lied to y'all. I lied. I knew I lied. I'm sorry. <laughs> the last Easter item I picked up were two of these wooden eggs. Y'all, I'm trying to be good, okay? I'm trying to be good at Dollar Tree. It's so hard. It's so hard. Like, I wanted to pick up, like, five of these, right? So, I had them in my stash, whatever, whatever. But then I got to store this stuff. And, like, I'm running out of room, y'all. I'm seriously running out of room. So, I only picked up two of those. Let me get a little closer, y'all. I'm sorry. <clears throat> All right. Moving along. These are new and I'm super excited. How many times can I say super? Huh. 
to know me is to love me, okay? Sorry, y'all. Sorry, not sorry. I gotta be me, and whatever comes out of my mouth just comes out of my mouth. I don't know what to say. But, um, straight pins. So, I, I do have a pin cushion out in the shed. But I'm like, what are they selling pin cushions for? They don't have no straight pins. Well, now they do. And I don't sew usually. I can sew. I have a sewing machine. I can hand sew. Um, but I ain't got time for all that. What I use these for, if you guys caught my shed video, then you know what I'm about to say. If you did not know, I have a sh gorgeous craft crafty she shed. And uh, my husband redid the entire inside. It's insulated, heat, air, all the things. Um, and I showed a video moving back out there last week because I recently had a baby five months ago and I had to move crafting inside for a while because I'm breastfeeding and it was hard to get out there. Um, so I filmed getting back out there and I showed you guys my ribbon storage and it's on um, threaded rods on my pegboard and they unravel a lot and it drives me nuts. My OCD is like, oh my gosh, I can't handle that. So what I do is I just take the straight pins and I stick that in the end of the ribbon to keep it together. So um, I was actually almost out. So I was really excited to see that. All that to say, I put these in my ribbon and I'm super excited to see these. It doesn't say how many you get in a pack, but there's a right good bit in there. So two of those. I was so excited to see these, you guys. I have never seen these before. Are you freaking kidding me? Dollar Tree. And you give us the letters. Now, I don't really like those letters. I will probably make my own letters, to be quite honest. Um, but, I mean, for $1.25, what? Because they seem kind of, well, they don't seem. They are really cheap. It's like a cheap piece of like cardstock but still for a dollar 25 the faux wood look with the letters with a jute hanger i mean you can't beat that you could totally judge this up with some diy and make it look super duper high end so i picked up two of those it was the only two that my store had it's the name of the game if there's a bunch, I don't take the whole thing. But, I mean, I'm sure there was a bunch floating around that I just couldn't find. Because, y'all, I have ADHD and I'm like a squirrel in Dollar Tree. I'm like, oh, crap, look at that. Oh, crap, look at that. And and I don't have time to be, like, searching around. I don't have time for all that. So, my eyes are, like, darting all around. And I, I'm sure I miss a lot of stuff. But, anyway, picked up two of those. I don't care if you come for me in the comments for picking up both of them. You would have done the same thing. So, don't come for me. Anyway. Oh, no. I broke this one. Shoot. Oh, well. Thank God for hot glue, right? The next item I picked up was this Farm Fresh Little Cow. Now, I'm not really digging the colors, y'all. It's not my favorite. So, DIY it is. I mean, I do kind of like how it looks like shiplap, but... I don't really like the font or the colors, so I feel like if I at least painted it, it would at least look a little better, right? Um, but anyway, it's got a little light in here. You just pull the tab. Hopefully, I got one that worked, huh? Okay, there we go. Me show y'all. Super cute. So this would be really cute on like a tiered tray. And then, like I said, it I need to glue it. So it would be even cute if you just pulled that off and like used it on something else. So yeah. I only picked up one of those. And I have hauled before there is a chicken. And there is a pig as well, but I already had those. I didn't really like the colors anyway, so I didn't pick up any more. 
but I did just want to show y'all this one. I also picked up these Jot gel pens, one millimeter super glitter. I love pens, y'all. I am a freaking pen freak. So bad. So bad. So I loved, and my daughter is too. She's just like her mama. Well, both my daughter. <laughs> Melissa can't ever talk. What else is new? Both my daughters are pen freaks. All right, let's see how it writes. Oh, heck yeah. I love that. I love them. They write really, really smooth. It's, I had a feeling that was going to happen because I don't know if you guys have ever used um, glitter gel pens, but if you don't write on like an angle, okay, yeah, you got to write on an angle with these because if you don't, it doesn't come out right. So anyway, I picked up one pack of those. Thank you guys for bearing with me and hanging with me, y'all. I ain't got time to be editing, so it just is what it is. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. <laughs> there's the unsub. There's the X button here, there, or wherever. You ain't gonna hurt my feelings. I get it. I'm not everybody's cup of tea, and that is all good, okay? Just like everybody ain't my cup of tea. I could say a lot of things about a lot of people, but we'll save that story for another day. <laughs> anyway, y'all, look at this. Now, y'all know that Dollar Tree has the all silver ones. So I only picked up one to show you guys because I was like, shoot, I could paint it like that if I wanted it. But I just had to pick it up to show you guys because I know a lot of people like the navy blue white look. I personally, it's not my style. I personally like white and black better. However, I really, really do like that. I think it's gorgeous. Um, you guys could save so much money doing a backsplash with this. Um, it, impressive. It's really impressive. Um, I did my backsplash with Chalk Couture and a transfer kind of like this. So I think that's what draws me to like this pattern um, because I have something pretty similar in my kitchen. In a second, I'll take you out there and show you. But yeah, I, I love, love, love this. But again, I had a bunch, I have a ton of silver ones. So picked up one of those. The next item I picked up, I finally found them, you guys. I finally found them. The black canvases. I've never seen them in any of my stores. I've seen several people use them, but I just could never find them. So I picked up two of them and they are eight by 10. That's what I thought, but I wanted to be sure. So two eight by 10 stretch canvases, all natural cotton. And it does have real wood base. Um, so I like to take, f with the white ones, I like to take off the canvas and make like windows with them. I have a really, really cute window idea. Um, not with these, but I have a cute window idea. I've already made windows, but this is a little bit different. If you guys wanna see that, let me know down in the comments. Okay, and then the last few items I picked up, these are for my babies. Um, I've never seen anything like this at Dollar Tree, and I thought that was a really good item for $1.25. It's a little snack container. And y'all, this boy is five months old already feeding himself, okay? Like, he's a breastfed baby, but I have started um, weaning, not weaning, I have started giving all my kids like baby food and baby stars and the stuff that melts super quick, like four to six months. And we started him on like stars and snacks and stuff a couple weeks ago. And you guys, he's so freaking smart. I can dip the spoon in the food, 
hold the spoon out, he will grab the spoon and feed himself already. Like that boy impresses me more and more every day. And I'm just so blessed to be their mom, you guys. There was a time in my life where I didn't think I would make it past another day, to be quite honest. Um, I, sh I like to share my story because I hope that it can help other people see that a better life is completely possible if you want it bad enough. If you didn't know, I'm a recovering heroin addict, almost nine years clean again. Sorry, y'all, I can't talk. But next month in April, I will be nine years sober. I used to be homeless. Um, I've been through a lot of things in my life and I was just tired and I reached out for help. I met my husband, I moved away and i completely turned my life around i'm super proud of myself and i'm even more proud of you guys for sharing your comments with me down in the comment section because it helps me to feel confident enough and feel comfortable enough to open up and share to help other people because i know that when i was in my addiction i thought that a better life was not possible i thought that i could never get clean and I'm here to tell you that, sorry about that, my husband called. But um, yeah, I just, I honestly thought a better life was not possible, you guys. I thought that I was, I thought that I would be dead. I have overdosed like seven times and it's by the grace of God that I'm still sitting here in front of you. I know that I was saved for a reason and I believe like I never knew why I was always upset and mad that the people saved me. I truly did not care about my life. I truly wanted to die. And every time they would save me, I would say, God, why did you save me? Why? And I now realize that I was meant for a higher purpose. I was meant to share my story with you guys, help you guys DIY beautiful things for an outlet uh, crafting is my therapy. I don't know about you. This is my therapy. Connecting with you guys is my therapy. Teaching you guys how to make an online income from your phone, which I did not think was possible, is my therapy, is my passion. If you guys want to join business with me, um, drop or yeah, drop the word biz or text my number, the word biz. I would love to help you. Or if you um, want to lose weight or get better energy or focus or mood you guys it literally changed my life I would have never started sharing my story if it wasn't for this journey that I have been on the last two years so anyway all that to say I love you guys so much and I want you to know a better life is completely possible if you just reach out and grab it and I am here to show you that you're amazing and you can do whatever you set your mind to. So anyway, um, I know, I don't even know how I got on that. <laughs> oh my God, you guys. I trained 600 people today and I'm just like mind blown by that. If you would have told me a year ago that I would be training other people, I would have told you you're batshit crazy, okay? Anyway, y'all. Oh, I know how. I never thought I would have kids. So, um, I just love picking stuff up for my kids. My kids are my everything. And I picked him up a little snack container. So, I thought he might have fun, like, trying to get in there to get it. Or, you know, when you go out, throw that in your diaper bag. Um, these are perfect for that. Whoa. The other item I thought was super cool was this little bath shampoo rinse. That's freaking nice, you guys. I just bought one from Dollar Tree for like $11, super similar to this. So I picked up one of those. And then the last item I picked up, <gasps> I'm gonna cry. I'm not really gonna cry, but like y'all, this makes me super emotional. Excuse me. I picked up my 100K balloons because you guys, I couldn't have done it without you. And we are literally about to hit 100K on this channel super soon. I think we're like 4K away, you guys. I literally would not be here. I wouldn't do anything. Like I literally owe my life to my husband, to my dad and to you guys because you guys make me get up every day and wanna be a better person and strive for 
you know, the stars that I never went, that I never thought that I could reach. And picking up these balloons, like, you guys, I can't even believe it. So do me a favor. If you enjoy me, if you enjoy my content, if you want to follow my journey, if you want to join my business and let me teach you how to make cash money, like, what would $25,000 extra cash do for you? Because that is what you're eligible for to make in your first year, just in bonuses alone. That's not even your commissions. Or you guys, if you want help with anything at all, if you just want a friend, text me, you guys. I love chatting with you guys. I love connecting with you guys. Anybody who has talked to me knows that I'm not just all about business and this, that, and the third. Like, I, I spend a lot of time getting to know you guys, chatting with you guys, loving on you guys, telling you guys you're amazing because I didn't have that for a very long time. So if I can be that for somebody else, it really fills my heart right up. So you guys, 100K. Ah! So please share this out. Type the word shared in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Let's get to 100K, you guys. I owe it all to you. I love y'all so damn much. That is it for this haul. Thank you so much for hanging with me. If nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning. You are worthy. You are gorgeous. You literally can do anything you set your mind to. Coming from an addict who is almost nine years sober, if I can do it, you can do it as well. I love y'all so much. I'll catch you in the next one. Look out for a DIY or a Timu organizing video. One or the other is coming on Friday. I love you guys so much. Check out Bye. the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.